Okay. Uh, we should be coming back right now. Yeah, my GPU is still being used for like 70%. I don't like it that high at all, actually. I don't. 71%. I want it to be... To, let's go to standard. Let's see what happens. That drops it down to... Yeah... Oh wow. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Uh standard. That's fine. That's fine. I want that normal. Hi. Hi. Glare could be standard. Hi. Apply. Let's see what it does. Uh, 56%. Wow. Wait, what? Oh, I did not have to wait for 72 minutes when I was doing the ultimate um, ballot. Then again, I was playing as a healer. Okay, processor up to 40%, CPU going fine. Okay, I will just have to leave it at this. There's one thing that I might be able to do. And that would be in here. Increasing the frame rate, but it should be at 82%. You can clearly see I'm at 55. It's definitely... Still having issues. I can't change it any better than this. It still looks okay. But I need a graphical card. Here we go. And we can actually move back to Gradania. Actually healing is more intense. Actually. Because you're very much going to be... The sole one making sure your tank doesn't get himself killed. And in terms of healing, it's not as much as you think it is. It's more about DPSing anyways. It's actually quite fun. I actually like playing as a scholar. The heart of the party, yeah. I. If it isn't Une, how went the meeting with the Sylphs? There you go. Uh, I was also wondering if you got to do the word go. I, um. Yeah, I've not been doing it at all, actually. On this, on this one, because I don't want to level up my guys too fast. I miss this from the elder, uh, the self elder herself, if I may. So the sylphs have no desire for conflict, nor do they intend to summon remove. And as long as we leave the tempted ones be, we not need uh, we need not to fear any aggression on their part. The other seats here will be overjoyed to hear this that the Sills are have welcomed our overtures. And in the knowledge that they bear us no ill will, we may channel our resources towards tackling the more conspicuous threats of our security. You have done this nation a great service, my friend. On behalf of all Gradanians, I'll give you my thanks. Give me my money. Uh, another little trick of you. You can click right clip to the spot. Put a quest. Quickly and drop easier. Landing. Yeah, no, I have that. Um, I did that. Especially when I'm doing like turn-ins from guild or from uh, dungeon runs. I just have it on, on, on one, on zero. Yeah, they should actually tell you. It is true. Um, back from the woods. We get another 10 tickets? I'll take it. I should probably go to Ulda. Uh, the Sylphic folk have been... Have, have long been friends to Gradania. The mere thought of being at war with them pained the Elder Seeds here to no end. 
but owing but owing to our efforts she will be able to rest easier being the benevolent soul that she is my lady will surely try to find a way to reverse the tempted process once again i thank you had the signs of the seven dawn not offered their mediation between our peoples um, suspicion and doubt may well have led us into needless conflict pray pass on my regards to lady minfilia will do will do hello hello une can you hear me it's i minfilia they always call it the right possible moment uh, Ida and Papa Limo returned some time a while ago, and they wasted no time in regaling me with the tale of your exploits. Thanks to a large part of you, the name of one of the primals may be stuck from our may be struck from our enemy's list. Ah, so that is that. Yeah, okay, that's the beard one. And the Gridanians may turn their attention to a more pressing matter. Well done. Yet the end of one tale is but the start to another. Pray return to the walking sands at your earliest convenience. I would appreciate I would apprise you of the present situation in person. Alright, time to go. I think I think we should be preparing ourselves, I think, for the Titan. At least I hope so. Odin popped. Uh Odin popped. Guys. Um also let's return to Limsa first. Hopefully the the change in qualities will actually help. And let's go to the F castle. That is not what I'm what I wanted to do. And let's deliver. I think we did do and take. We did a dungeon and we got some. Oh, we can't do this yet. Oh, I keep forgetting we can't do this yet. We need to level up the FC rank. Yeah, yeah, we need to do that. I think I'd actually. What, what I will probably do is probably go for Conjurer. And then do some roulettes. No, it has to be different. What we need to do is the hunts. We need to do these. This will give us so many uh, scrolls that we can actually uh, re level up. It should do fine. Should be okay. Anyways, let's get ourselves the Vespa Bay token. See, all of this we can actually turn in. I can't do that just yet. Oh, it's such a quiet day today. Brave new depths. Going for gold. What level? 32. Okay, well, we're not there yet. Well, if it isn't my favorite adventurer, welcome back, Una. Lady Manfilia awaits you within the solar. Please enter at your leisure. Sure, you can say leisure as well. not voiced I am given to understand that the matter of Ramun has finally been resolved um, I fear resolved bespeaks a permanence we cannot rightly claim yet I am well satisfied that the Lord of Levin will not trouble us in the foreseeable future your satisfaction and your satisfaction is assurance enough for me how fares the investigation? Well enough. Denrens is, is sparing no effort. They're just 
There are many and one, just as you suspected. Their purpose, however, eludes us still. I see. Ah, I've been meaning to ask. What is Alicia quite is but is Al is Alicia quite well? I feel as if it have I feel as if I have scarcely seen her in the recent days. Ah you haven't and nor have I, alas. Alicia has chosen to walk her own path. Stubborn girl. But you may have you but you may be assured that our destination remains the same. It's a letter. And on that note, I take my leave of you. I trust that a Baldesian reports will serve you well. I take it we can proceed as disgusted. Why do you ask? You scarce need my permission to act. Hmm. What are you laughing about, boy? <laughs> ah, it's good to see you again, Una. Uh, if everything is fine as long as he keeps his mouth shut. I've been looking forward to congratulation, congratulating you on your triumph in the Twelveswood. Owing to your efforts, conflict has been averted. Truly, you have done. You have done the science proud. With that, we can strike Ramut from the list. So, who's next? The Shagarin and Leviathan? The Lord of Roll has not answered his minion's call of late, nor is he expected to do so in the near future. While the, Shag the Shagarin remains as aggressive as ever, they lack the quantity of crystals required to call forth their god. As with the Sylphs, we can leave them to their own devices. For a time at least. For a time, bears repeating. We can ill afford to fall compl complacent. It is as Yustola says. Unless we know the minds of the beast tribes, we cannot predict with any certainty that next that when next a primal will return to plague the land that being the case we must proceed uh, with as much haste as presence allows of prudence allows any word on okay we are going to titan there we go the maelstrom keeps the kobolds under constant observation we shall hear from them ere long. We may depend on it. Indeed. So then... Of all the known primals that have been active in recent times, we are left with... Oh my god, Gridania? Uh, wait, I mean... Garuda? No, Garuda is too early, right? Who is the primal? Um, who is the primal of the exile who live near the Gridania? Yes, that's what I meant. So many melms to cover. What would? Uh, what would there? Would that there were a more efficient way to conduct our surveys? Were he still with us, we should not long have waited for a more. Protectable solution? Alright, I guess. She's not wrong there. Where in the world are you, Chief? But one sure step at a time. Henceforth, the Order of the Twin Edda will handle all matters prepare, uh, per pertaining to the Sylphs. Under the sage guidance of the Cetius. I bet you all uh, I bet you all enjoy a moment's respite. You have earned it. 
And by that, she probably puts us to a mission right away. That's usually how it goes, right? Is there something else, Una? Oh, I guess there is a lot. Beg pardon? A man named La Brea? Spotting a red mask and robed in black. 12 preserve. Prior to the calamity, the Askians took great pains to remain hidden. Why would they choose to cast off their veil of secrecy now? Gods, this bodes ill. We must have we must take advantage of the present lol lol in primal hostilities and investigate this lair brea learn all we can from him and his designs i dread to the eek <laughs> oh god are we being attacked tataru Well, that's not nice. And the leafed ones return. A sylph? In Tenelan? At long last, this one finds walking one Una. This one is, mo is most dependable of those ones. I send by elder one Frixio to help walking ones. This one is called Norexia. This one comes as a friend. Let these ones be friends. Well, even the sylph is higher than her. Pleasure to meet you, no uh, Nora. I'll just call her Nora. Don't want to bust my brains already. Even more than I need to. Okay. Now, at 30, we have a lot of things to turn in. Go back to the Solon, even though we actually just left. And Menphilia has something else. Yes, Tataru is as ready to express her fright as she is to express everything else. Not all of us are forged from the same steel as you, I'm afraid. But it takes all kinds to make a family. And it pleases me with, uh, to no end to see ours continue to grow. One by one, the people of Eorzea begin to unite. Una, draw to the hope that shines within you. Yet, a darkness threatens to engulf this light. Never have I doubted the ascension, uh, the Askian's presence. But that they have grown so brazen as to carry out their work in plain sight fills me with a sense of deep foreboding. Okay. Level 24 still. I'm afraid there is no rest for the weary, Una. We must delve further into the motivations of the masked man. The, Sa the Askian known as La Brea. This is an ideal moment to do so, while our hands are not bound dealing with another primal. At present, we know little and less about the Askians, only that destruction follows in the wake. I should not be surprised if their be being, beings are behind the chaos that wrecks the realm. If my fear proves to be a reality, we must do all in our power to stop them. Earlier, I sent word to each grand company to, solid, to solicit cooperation. The immortal frames responded to the effect that they have information on a potential sighting. This is intelligence that we can ill afford to ignore. Go speak with the flame commander Swift in the Hall of Flames in Uldar to inquire further. How you go about the investigation thereafter, I leave wholly in your discretion. But whatever you do, never forget that we are dealing with the unknown. We cannot take too many precautions. Be safe, Una. Easy as pie.
So let's go to Ulda. Yeah, when when shall we decide on doing a few of these uh, grand company hunts? Um, I need to be actually over there. Nice. I really like this town quite a bit. But this time we decided to join the Immortal Flames. Uh, there you go, Swift. A masked man. Ah. You are come on behalf of the science, of course. Yes. We have already relayed to Lady Benthelia. There has been sighting of a rogue near about Eastern Taladon. Oh yeah, the hunts are going to be fun. Yeah, the f yeah. But uh, it, it's actually if we, if we do all of these hunts, the Grand Company hunts, you should probably become lieutenant by the time you're done with it. A brass blade stationed in Highbridge described him in detail when he alerted us to suspicious activity. I would point you to the witness, but I'm afraid he died not two days ago, slain by a marauding horde of Kukwin. Wait, these are these guys that make the fire water. Fate can be a cruel mistress, but do not be too quickly to despair. Being situated on the trade route, hybrid sees its fair share of travelers. Folk are always coming and going, and some among them may well have caught a glimpse of your target. You could do worse than to speak with a merchant named Ihi Baru. Ihi Baru. The fellow's always staffed for customers and he's no doubt welcomed your attention. Whether or not you have coin on mind or to spend it. Yeah, I'm still debating. Should we just get ourselves leveled so when we do the roulettes We'll get more, we'll see. We'll decide when we reach like Titan. Let's go to Camp Drybone. And we still haven't been here in a little Alamigo. We should, I think we're actually going there. I think this is where Titan should be. And let's go, we need to go over there. That bridge won't do. So what is everyone doing currently? I wonder. Beast stripes. Should I go potato? I would earn tons of respect. Really? Why? why? Why would you earn tons of respect if you go Lollafell? And you're doing beast tribes. Ooh. Yeah. Welcome to Highbridge Adventurer. Whatever you seek, I, he, Baru, can provide it. Probably. Not meant seriously. Oh, <laughs> okay. I was like, what? No way. You're after a masked man. Hmm. I'm not sure if I if I have one of those in stock. Oh, you're after a masked man. Why didn't you say so sooner? Such an individual might have featured in one of many rumors I've heard. If you linger a while, mayhap you'll learn a thing or two, eh? Level 29. Meaning one more level and we can meet Jack again no I don't wanna but that also means that since we're still quite early leveled I think we probably have to start doing um, an arcanist I'm not sure yet if I want to go scholar or white mage white mage is quite good with the region that comes with the um, the AOE heal Scholar is great with shields and can actually put shields on everyone at later level. 
or just heal a bunch. It's actually more like damage mitigation than healing. Fairy could now look okay with Une. Not sure yet. Okay, let's talk to this fella. We'll get Salem Pink Dye. Well, ain't that nice? White Mage would fit your character's look like a white dragon. I like your thinking a lot. When the order of... Oh my god, here we go. Uh, Naltal... Naltal began excavating the ruins below. I had hopes that High Bridge would turn into a bustling hop of pilgrims. But thanks to the nigh endless beastmen raids, folk are too afraid to come within a mile of here. I sold everything I owned to get my venture started. I am loaded to give up without making the earliest effort to stick it out. But if things keep going as they are, I'll be bankrupt before the moon is true. Whining. Let's go first person. Let's just do it like this. There you go. Oops. Did not read that. The masked man, but tell make your blood bloody masked men. I know what I said before, but vague rumors are all I've got. If you want to know about him, go ask other merchants. Yeah, we should probably go indeed white mage then. I think the uh, suggestion there is quite good. I'll start over here. Ah. I've heard tell of a masked devil. Seems he uh, seems he's been appearing not only around Highbridge, but elsewhere about Talon too. Enough folk have reported seeing him to convince me he's more than a figment of the imagination. But little is known about him otherwise. That's very useful information. Yeah, walking forced first person is actually quite nice. Uh, on the trail of a masked man, I I've heard of him, but only in hushed, hushed tones in faith whispers. It's said he wears a black hooded robe and looks right suspicious. And that's about all I can say, little though it is. Uh, such a friendly character. So why are you doing the beast stripes? Like I I know you there's a crafting beast stripe and stuff like that, but yeah, it's especially good when you got like sights you want to show the audience, like a big statue, siding of a cliff. Yeah, I used to I actually usually walk in cities and out of combat in first person. I just didn't do it last stream and didn't actually think about it this time. Oh dear lord, what are you saying? Completionism? Com completionisting? You can buy some stuff from different currency than poetics. Some ugly mounds. Wait, they have mounds? Hell yeah, I'll do all of them. Yeah, it's set. We'll do all of them. Also, Beast Drive have nice stuff in store, like dice. So here is a impassive merchant. Have I seen a masked man wearing a dark robe? No, I haven't. Nor do I wish to. Business is bad enough without shady characters lurking about. Folk have been giving Highbridge a wide breath because of all the uh, Kukurinth raids. None but the most devoted of pilgrims are willing to come here anymore. Okay, so this place is definitely... Yeah, I like it. Yeah, that's that's really good. The view is absolutely... You see Ulda over there? So damn gorgeous. Uh, I love that. And yeah, without pressing the MSQ, I need stuff to do. This is the filler. Mm, so... 
Why are you not progressing the MSQ then? Judging by your expression, I take it you didn't learn much of use. Look, I'm sorry for my rudeness earlier. It's just that things are tough for us merchants at the moment. The raids are so consist uh, constant, so organized, we're beginning to suspect that someone is orchestrating all of it. You don't want to go too far ahead? That's very friendly. Ahead of everyone, or ahead of me, or... I tend to put my own welfare first, like most of us do, but that doesn't mean I'm a bad person. I promise to keep an eye out for your masked man. If I see or hear anything, you'll be the first to know. Cool. I finally got some honest to good to God's information on your masked man. Why so confident? Because I saw him with my own two eyes. I was out for an evening stroll, minding my own business, when I noticed a column of smoke rising from a cliff over Talon's respite. Curious, I took myself there and find a masked man. Your masked man, I'm sure of it, standing by a fire. As if in answer some current appeared soon after, and the group began talking in length, I'm afraid it was too far out of earshot to hear much of anything. After the group had dispersed, the idea came to me. If you were to use this smoldering coal to start a fire, you might be able to arrange a similar meeting. It will be dangerous. It shouldn't be, it shouldn't be doubt. But you've proven yourself more than a match for a pack of rats. Really? How do you know? So, what do you think? That, um, that's some sound, reliable information, even if I do say so myself. Well worth all the lingering... Yeah, lingering about you, about you have been doing, about you have been doing, wouldn't you say? Whatever. Oh wait, he's just we're lingering and just waiting. Uh, mostly new, mostly you. I mean, a ton of characters and twerks. Well, oh, that's so kind. I, I, will, I will, I will, promise to put more effort in my uh, leveling the MSQ. I'm sorry. Yeah, you must have been waiting for long, and then I restarted a character. You must be like, oh, you absolute asshole. Sometimes like Eureka. Uh, yeah. Ita no sleep. Ita needs no sleep. Ita is tired. He will go without sleep. Alright, now since we're on the road again. <laughs> no sleep. <laughs> no sleep. So what are you doing, uh, Wenek? How's the printer doing? Redeem a hydrate. You, you just want to make me pee. That's what you want to do. It's empty again. Let me get something to drink. Uh, what? It's dead for now? Yeah, this is also one of the reasons why I want to... 
get a new graphical card, it's, it's Diablo 4. Where's the audio? Oh, there we go. So, uh, let me ask you guys, because e e even you, Ida, and as well as Wenek, you're very you familiar with, with stuff. If you had to select a 4070, which one would it be out of all the brands? Usually I go MSI, but apparently the... MSI Venture. I don't have anything to the answer. Um, the MSI one, the heating pipes don't go to the uh, all of the right areas. Apparently, they all come with the same. Well, not completely. Apparently, the MSI one struggles with a lot of heat issues. Apparently, I I don't know. Uh, meant to view. Yeah, there is that thing indeed. Yeah, the VRAM. And apparently the MSI one is um, is not having any things to uh, relay the heat down. And I was looking at PNI, PNI, and apparently it actually has been doing great because I also wanted to be silent. I don't like noisy stuff. I would see AV again. I don't. Uh, PNY. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. And yeah, let's let's go to do this one. Let's go use call. Uh, need more caffeine in my system. Oh, yeah, because actually, um, Helen uh, is also from Germany, so he is suffering through the night like us. Either. It's a corpse breaking foot soldier? Wait, we're fighting corpses? Um, but yeah, that is actually the one which is actually coming okay out of the test. But I'm also looking into um, Eno 3D. I just don't know, man. There's so many of them. And I kind of want to keep it somewhat low budget. Because the 4070 in general will give me like a an increase in graph card about a hundred percent, and and I'm not looking into the TI or the 4080 or the 4090 because I don't have that money. But I kind of want to know like there are differences, whether it be do heat. Or ventilations, like the programs. I don't overclock. Uh, how much for the 4070? I've, I could actually get him for 635 or 36 right now. Yeah, creating more noise and heat. Yeah, I was worried about that. Back so soon. Were you able to find any clues leading to a masked man? Yeah, we got like dead soldier attacking us. Um, in Germany, we call it Felsen Bern, or literally Cliff Bear. Oh, cool! My German absolutely is horrible. Why not go with Founders Edition? Yeah, precisely that. <laughs> it ain't America. This this scroll it bears prayer to Ralgar the Destroyer. In case you're unfamiliar, Ralgar is the guardian deity of Alamingo, which is currently under Gallian rule. It's highly uncommon for folk of other nations to reserve him, to revert to rever him. I wager my last guild that your assailant was. Alamingal. Alamingal. Your pronunciation was pretty good. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. Yeah, I know. Wenek is absolutely like, oh my god, what's going on? No, you, you would have to actually look up the European one, Wenek. I kind of want to know 
which one would be decent because with a 4070 i think i can definitely go for like another year or two the 2060 super i'm using yeah it's struggling more and more and more it seems this mask man of yours is very well connected i must confess the merchant in me envies such a diverse network of contact that self same merchant also sends danger ahead the darkness besides are you certain you ra you rather not take things nice and slow here at highbridge no you need something with a lot of vram true i need something with a lot of vram but also something that is not noisy nor needs like 300 watts of power because power is power the more i have in reserve the better in my weird oh we actually are going to little aluminium let's go the alamingan bandit you had a run-in with is somewhat connected to your mask man of mystery so it stands to reason that you want to pick up the trail again. You should head towards uh, Little Alamillo to the southern Teladon. Just so you know what to expect, the settlement is favored destination for those refugees who couldn't, well, adapt to life in Ulta. The hearts of the dissidents are said to be as barren as the wasteland they live in. And for all intentions and purposes, it's a lawless place. Be prepared for a not so warm welcome. Now, I'm not certain how much help she will be, but it just so happens I have a daughter who is uh, relocated to Little. Her name is Hihira, and it shouldn't hurt to seek her out first. And while you have her attention, I'd be obliged if you could send my love. Not a day goes by that I don't think of her. I suppose this is it then. I had hoped that you would linger for a while, call some friends, spend some coin. What have you? But something tells me you are destined for greater things. Wherever it is you end up, I wish you the best. Uh, the 40 series is very lagbuster. Yeah, the problem lies when like, the 30 series is... The 3080 is, I think, like 11 to 1200 euros still. And that is because of the ability for those bloody crypto miners. Which I hate a lot for driving up prices. Complete jackasses. Mm -hmm. We have broader horizon over here. Crypto is down as hell. Yeah, but prices aren't. Camp Trinkle, we did. Wait, what? Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Alright, let, let's fix this. Let's fix this. I did not attune there. What did I say? When you get to some place, attune. Yeah, of course, um, they want to see the monies. I get that. I would not. I I, I I I would do the same thing. Uh, we need to go actually down here, which is going to be extremely crowded. Ooh, there we go. Hello. I spy with my little eye. But still, I'm very curious to what graphical card would do uh, because i want to buy actually two of them one for me one for the wife and hey actually there is currently a uh a deal if you buy a 
Wait, I didn't do the leaves over here? Are you kidding me? What else have I been failing at? Um, you'll get Diablo 4 with a 40 series. So yeah, I think that's actually quite interesting. Yeah, when I was tiny, I went. I but didn't issue. Uh, oh well. Okay, let's go take the test. Accept that. Yeah, I'd rather just do them right now because oh my god, I uh, actually didn't do that last time, and it was annoying. Okay. We can get tired of pacify by the bottle of Stossens. Okay, let's weaken the target. Angered Elms and the Angered Elms. There we go. There's an Angered Elm. And these ones we need to... Alright. Alright, that's one. Treasure, we get a potion of vitality. Oh, nice. Alright, duty's done. Yeah, I just, I just, I'm not very familiar with, uh, with that brand. So, I'm, I'm a bit... Relentless. The other one is, I think it's like Eno 3D. That apparently can be okay. Let's get the money. Okay, that one is now done. And a colleague of mine who is into building computers for people actually sold one of them and he says like yeah well he's fine it's a it's a, the graphical card has two ventilators and usually i want to go with three for whatever reason like i don't know if it's very necessary but you know i don't know like i always go like two is better than three is better than two uh, but apparently from the edo 3d as well as the pny the ventilation is quite good Apparently. Okay, this time we um, we will actually bind to the crystal so I don't have to walk back. Also, I'm hoping that since we're now level 29, we could at least deliver the 30 missions. And then we need to make a decision. What will we do? Are we going to get that white mage going? It would be easy for dungeon runs. Never heard of him. We'll eat a burger. Ooh. Is it that very good burger? Alright, where is that mission? Extra Big Burger. So that is over there in Gradania. Oh, we can open up that gate. Oh, that is not bad at all. Also, we need to go check the flowers 
in the house. See if they're all done. Yeah, let's go to the gate. Okay, it seems like my FPS has stabilized. Um... Let's see if we what would actually change if we start changing these up to high. Yeah, it's I think it's the shadows that does the most. Let's go with simple with party members. Uh, I could help after stream. Yeah, the problem is the problems occur when I stream. Like, I don't notice it in game. But it's because I noticed that there is frame skip due to rendering delays that I know it's my, my GPU. That's the problem. Uh, only those who possess a gate pass may travel to the White Wolf Gate. It is for your own good. For reason, for fearsome beasts uh, that lurk beyond would tear an unprepared adventurer limp from limp. You have papers. Let us see. Now, yes, everything appears to be in order. Go in safety, Une, in the future. Should you wish to pass, you need only say the word. Okay, right, let's see. Earring. Strength, vitality, and tenacity. That is actually quite good for a tank let's take it now we will put this in our armory and let us switch to our marauder for a second let's see if something happens and there you go they actually equip this so we have some more tenacity save that let's go rogue Yeah, we'll have to wait until reaching level 30 to make a decision because I want to do the final job quest. And here I am, promising that we are doing a lot of work. And then, yeah, not so much. I know. I know, I'm sorry. Let us go to... I think Camp Drybone would be the easiest one. Actually, no. If we go to Uldar, teleporting to... Central Talon. That's a very easy walk over there. So let's go to Ulda. Look, the higher I can get the graphical settings, the more happy I will be. Uh, yeah, that's the one. Yeah, the central... Yeah, definitely. Definitely, I agree. And it's just over over that gate. Look at this. Let's not... Uh, okay, let's not make a picture of my bird's ass. There you go. I uh, would be like uh, very up close and personal, wouldn't it? Let's go. Saboteurs. Oh, hey. I think I actually uh, got Helen in this. Yeah, definitely. I was farming these um, these guys for the ladder. I needed a hundred of them. And he was crafting over there. Good times. And there's the leaves as well, so we have a leaf quest. Uh, okay, first things first, before talking. Crystal. Shall we do the leaf quest immediately? I think that would be probably best. 
Um, actually, yes. Let me change something for you, mate. Uh, members. Actually, is that possible? Let's take a look. You will be... Do, would you be crafting some for the, the free company stuff as well, right? Let's take a look. Yeah, you've been making progress. I think you would be doing perfect. Let's go do this. Um, Helen. There you go. Go check it out. If you have rocks, you can use rocks. Greetings and welcome to... Yeah, let's do that. He's going to be testing us. We all know what he will do. Um, I could do more hydrate. Do it. I traveled near every distance because I wanted to save money. Wow. Wow, you are dedicated like crazy, dude. Now, I actually had to scrape by the very first time I created a character. Oh, man. I absolutely had to sell everything. In order to get some of those things gone. The game is like 50 times as long. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. It is that long. Let's initiate this. Confirm. Um, we need to... Get at the missing pages. Alright. That, that is not too difficult. That's one. Yeah, you go go check out if we have anything you can use it, mate. Okay, he didn't have actually actually it did. Two out of five. Awesome. Um, at rank. Let's take a look. Um, info entitlement. When we go rank 12, we have a, we can do more actions. I don't care much about the actions, to be fair. But at rank 15 is chest expansions. What we can do is decoration stuff in there as well. Who knows what it's good for. Three out of five. Let's kill a few more. Because I want to make sure that the house looks great. I also want to save up to get a large house instead of the small one. I saw that. This is a corpse. Like, how? Five out of five. We're done. We're done. Oh, there we go. Um, you can craft placeable food items which members can partake. Yeah, I was actually... Also looking into um, stands for like retainers and stuff like that, like armor crafters and stuff. There is actually stalls for them, but yeah, we don't have that much. Holy crap, that is so cool. The white elephant. I think we might level up. No, we're close to it. Quest was completed. Yeah, won't be long until we make a new class. Leaves are now unlocked. You only have to do that once.
Uh, one of the stars should be buyable from Beast Vendor. That is good to know. Oh, why? Yes. Ihi Baru is my father. He said, what? I wish I could be a better daughter to him. It's just that... I... I'm sorry. I shouldn't bother you with family matters. But I'm grateful to you for delivering the message. Now then, what brings you here? A masked man? I'm afraid the description doesn't ring any bells. But one of the others here may have seen something. I would recommend you first speak with uh, Gon Gondobald, the leader of the settlement. I must warn you though, he isn't exactly accommodating to outsiders. Okay, let's go first person again, like I said. Oh, wow, that's very close. See if the FPS drops again. So far, so good. Who are you? State your business and be quick about it. Looking for a masked villain, you say? Ah, uh, and why should we help you, Bray? We struggle enough uh, without having to answer the whim of every outsider. You are not welcome here. Be gone. And we get some orange dye. Uh, T for free. Okay, that's cool. I, I've, I've never looked into that at all. I might have to do that on this character. And we can get a cool ass bana bandana. I don't want glasses. Well met adventurer. I'm Gizzybird, head of security here in Little Alamigo. I hear tell that you had business with Gondobald. Knowing the grizzly old bear, I don't doubt he told you to bugger off. Owning to hardships, the refugees don't trust anyone but themselves. Not even my men and I can get so much as a word of thanks out of them, despite watching the plays day and night. But thanks or no, to help my fellow men when uh, to help, uh, I will try to help my fellow men when I can. And you seem a decent sort. If you tell me what brought you here, might be as I can lend a hand. On the trail of a masked villain, you say? Hmm. Can't say that sounds familiar. But I have men on lookout for Al Majar to the south of here. If there's any suspicious activities, they are like to have seen it. I had a mind to take them each a cup of sweet Italian tea, so as to lift their spirits. If you were to run in a, run this little errand in my stead, they'll be all the more willing to tell you what they know. I am their errand boy. Oh yes, I am. Yeah, where is that? That's actually quite a distance. Let's go. What would fit the description of the stall? Oh my, I don't know. I was actually just eyeballing the marketplace um, when I noticed that. The elephant is a Stormblood Beast Tribe mount. That is good to know. Okay, here we go. Flame Private. Who the hells are you? I'm trying to converse, uh, conserve energy here, so leave me alone. Here you go. Take a sip of the tea. Well, ain't that considerate? My thanks, friend. What's that? A masked villain hiding amongst the refugees? <laughs> like as not. My compatriots... Compatriots as live life here goes about as tough. They're dead on their feet. It's near impossible to tell what's on their minds. For all I know, they're all up to no good. Scroll up linked item. Uh, heavy armored carriage used for the armored yard transport supplies. Shop selling price. Interesting. 
Hey, we can test it out, you know. We can test if it's uh, if it's good. It's I think it's outdoor furniture. That means that we would have to remove probably one of the plants. I would definitely place it to see if it works, if if it's use uh, useful or usable. Oh, that's cool. Whoa. What the hell? He was... F oh, he was the one on the uh, on the dragon, I think. Well, I first need to level my repertoire, anyhow. Yeah, same. <laughs> Mine is zero. You there. Are you Almaja? No? Thank Are you kidding me? I don't even look like Almaja. Have you seen the Almaja? They're like huge-ass lizards. Idiot. Ah, this sophisticated aroma. It's been forever since I had a drop of sweet uh, talalan. Talalan. I'm going to enjoy this. What? A masked man? Don't know. Don't care. Unless he's got dark, shady skin, standing ten fumes tall, and has the face of a lizard, then I don't give him mama's fast. And you asked me if I... Never mind. Okay, my hope is on this Lullafell. And this is the Almaja. Lizard. Large as lizard. Shoo-hoo, don't bother me. If the Almaja overrun us, I'm blaming you. Now, well, you'll be dead, so you've, whatever. For me, you shouldn't have. Sorry. A suspicious masked man. As a matter of fact, I caught a glimpse of someone fitting the description on the, uh, during patrol. Well couldn't quite make out whether it was a man or not we're uh, that with a mask and a rope but assuming it was a he he was talking to some alamingans i assume he was one of them i assumed he was one of them go down What would the price be of a medium house and would it be worth it? For a moment there I thought this bird was a goner. Would it be worth it to go medium first before we go large? Ah, you're back. So, did my lookouts have all to share with you? Hmm, that doesn't sound like much to go by. If you're going to get any further in your investigation, Seems to me you'll need to you need the cooperation of the Alamingans. For this, you'll need to win the trust, uh, the trust, and that won't be an easy task. Yeah, we're level 30. Break. Market of death. Here we go again, Jack. We meet again. Okay, let's take a look how this looks. Actually, I like it. Maybe say for the larger would give us time to get a decoration along the way. I agree. We would also need to get up to, I think like 16 million or something. Yeah. Unfortunately, we'll have to wait with this. Let us go for the Market of Death. The class quest. And we need to decide, guys. You got barely enough for one room. My room is still empty. I, I recently dropped like a million in like decorations and other stuff. I've not looked into any room furniture whatsoever. <laughs> He's doing the mission. He's listening to gossip over there. Well, this is going to be fun, guys. I can't wait to finish this. I don't like Jack at all. 
Uh, here's the thing I did with my other character. Got Lemonian doll put in a boot, and there was a snake in my boot. Okay. So, someone here really likes to look like Kebe. The X Rogues have new information on the final missing treasure. I was wondering when you'd show up in it. But bugger me if you don't look ready to mill an entire crew of salt by yourself. And better that you are, cause we've finally uncovered some hard facts about the last treasure. Won't be long now, a fort, we cloy the winning piece and put this daft challenge to bed. Oh, alright, I've gathered the other code for a meeting. Let's go, let's get down to it. At long last, the black sarcophagus uh, has given up its secrets. On the foot, you have some news for us? Aye, Jack. I think half our troubles are whittling the truth of it lay in Colin. It's nasty thing, a treasure. The black sarcophagus is no dim dumble. It's the mark L1, LI. What's an L again? Isn't that 20, 25? Whatever, a me mega tech bell, a bleeding prototype explosive, or well, was bitten from an imperial transport vessel. And even though it ain't that big, maybe the size of a small cargo box, they say the blast have enough kick to incinerate a bloody behemoth. Seem, uh, seems the Guardians mean to start producing there at their factory in the Nostra. Then distribute the mines through Castrum Marinum. Lucky some plunky privateer clawed the prototype en route, eh? That's actually be They saved the bloody day then. An experimental weapon? That explains why the Telosotry has was so bleak eager to bid at the auction and so reluctant to share the details with us. Yeah, I bet. Don't want to give any pirates like a bomb. At least now we know what. But there's still the question of where. The girls delivered their bidden goods to the reformist? That much is certain. What happened to the sarcophagus after that though? We aren't too sure. There hasn't been any reports of huge explosions or the like. So either the executioners still have the mine, or they've peddled it to some other buyer. The reformist faction came together out of shared hatred for the admiral and her ways. I'm guessing they didn't clot that bomb just to sell it. What's up, Lone? Okay, what's going on? A letter. For you, Jack says it's urgent. I think it's going to be from the Admiral. A letter from who is it? An old man. I found it while I was sorting through our daily deliveries. Let's see now. Come to Talios. I have urgent news. I have known, I've never known the old man to summon a customer. Not one seems him at his usual haunts for a while. So do you reckon it's some rum morsel he dug, uh, he dug up just for us? Ah, it could be. Une, um, you and me had to uh, tally us on the foot for Kebe. You're to take another step at pinning down the location of the sarcophagus. Uh, where is that again? Oh! Wrong one. 
I thought so for a moment. I'm like, what? No way. Alright, let's go to Illport. There's a thing, um, wait, already read that. Let us go Chocobo. Start Russian. Okay, trying to do the faith. That's a good thing, actually. I should start doing those as well. I think you can meet great people with that. Marked for death. I think he's going to be in this tunnel. It seems like the most shady location. And it is. Uh oh. Uh. I think he's dead. Uh, can we just get you, please? And we get region. Well, he died. Ah, uh, it sucks. The region actually helps quite a bit. Wasting your time, darling. We opened that scratch wrecking throat bells ago. Oh, oh my. Oh, so this is a bloody executioner. You cross the bloody executioners and you get what's common to you. Did you like our message? We wasn't, uh, we wasn't sure you'd fall for it. But a little mystery goes a long way, eh? Let's go. Now, don't be like that, darling. Me and me mates didn't have much choice when the boss say, go play with the rogues. Then we go play with them rogues. After all, we've never asked you to come ruin our game now, did you? Did we? And won't give me long-winded speeches about precious code. The reformers' vision stretches far beyond what them tired old rules is good for. And captains... Oh, really? It's just spitting out the name. Uh, our captain, Isbering, takes command of the executioners. He'll give us back the thief we lost when we summoned the, uh, submit, submitted to the Admiral's leash. We'll be the terrors of the sea once more, free to roam and plunder in a new age of pirate glory. And I'll bait in blood to see that age come to pass. I'll kick down your shite, stinking coat and have all your sneaking hats on the chopping blocks. Like hell you will. The one sentence that has been passed today is yours. Okay, so the captain... Oh, hello there, darling. Ain't you a fine-looking lad? I've heard all this prattle for. Free to pillage and plunder, is it? Aye, it's all sound grand, but you don't think of the price. That shite stinking coat is the only thing that keeps you bloody coves from milling another, uh, one another. Without it, without Limsa Liminza to call home, You'd be adrift in the ocean of quarrel, a quarrison. But if you're so keen to keep company with the dead, 
I'll be sudden happy to oblige you. Ah, pretty with your grub shut, but I can see I'm out me debt here. Seriously? As much as I like to lop off your noggins, I'll have to be set aside with dragging the two of you out into the wilds. Kept you well out of way, haven't I? Out of it then. Out with it then. <laughs> Isn't it obvious? You stubborn crocs is looking to swipe your new toy and my job's to stall you. The captain has the mind with I'm right now. He's set, he's set to show the rest of the executioner that he's got the stones to sit the, in the leader's chair. <laughs> What's a better way of doing the executioner than a bitch snapped in the chain? Wait, really? He's going to be attacking the admiral? He's targeting the admiral himself. You're planning to blow up command room, aren't you? That'd be a permission to panic, of course. And I'd rather stay clear of the city. Be glad to keep your company right here, sweet meat. <laughs> I keep pressing the wrong one, and I'm, every time I'm confused. Alright, we have to go and talk with Jack again. We've got this mad maud at our mercy, but she seems to be overjoying herself. I better drag her back to the guild and see what information she'll spill. You need your, you'll need your backs and limbs as well. Put your business at the foremast first. You should find Captain Millen and her post there. Forget about the sudden challenge and tell her everything we know. Although, unless me judgment well off killed her, she'll do what needs to be done. Yeah. I think that's she's absolutely obnoxious. You got to be kidding me. I have to go. Oh, okay. So when we were doing an event, uh, we were actually over there doing a treasure. And I was like, I've never seen this door open. Never seen what's going on over there. And now I know. So that is the destination. I wonder if the door actually will open. Actually, we'll take the other way down. It's closer. I also don't want to jump. Too much damage. Now, you won't die from jumping, though. But still. You could just jump, like, down here. And I think the chocobo took the blunt of it. Speaking of it. No, it's still level 2. Here we are. And we have to deal with the miniature captain. Oh, you're one of Jack Rogues. You've come to steal the sorrows, have you? Well, that's... That's one way to keep them safe. Well, you shan't have them. As you can see, they're safely caps upon my very own, hmm? You're here for the earrings? The Admiral, you say? And you're sure about these fiends are in possession of the sarcophagus? I must apply more sentries at once. Do you not think this void... Uh, do not think this void shall challenge Rogue? And you can relay as much to your imprudent guildmaster. I suppose you can thank him for warning as well. Oh, okay, I was actually hoping we could enter now, but apparently not. 
Oh well, what can you do? It is what it is. So far, the frame rate's been doing great. Uh, it helps a lot that the others don't have shadows anymore. Yeah, let's go inside. So, the jackets are on the move, Benna. Got another one? Uh, another one of what? I've been listening to that... Adult panic crack since I got her back to the sisters, but she's given us not what we didn't already know, and we know more than enough. I'd say we ready the rogues and go after the mine after it blows up in our mums. Wrong chat. <laughs> okay, that's fine, mate. Hey, if you do happen to come across people that don't have like a free company, feel free to invite them, mate. But do ask them first. Ooh, that's... That's nice. Yeah, we'll go for the jacket. Hopefully it has more... Support. If the leader of the reformists, this captain... Is planning on milling the admiral with a bang... Then my guess is he'll be aiming to demolish the entire command room. You know the mizzen mast, eh? The tower that holds the drowning wrench, the end the bulwark hull, the admiral's bridge and her command room are right at the top of it. Then we've got to the we've got the district that surrounds the mizzenmast. That the busy beaten heart of the city, even with the threat of an attack, you can't just seal it up in the blink of an eye and call the whole thing Bob. Try to explain the danger to the coals, what's living and work there, and you'll have a very frightened, stampeding mob. Yeah, yeah, I bet. Now, Les. Your only opinion is to have eyes shillin', sh shilshin, and approach to the tower. I'll put the wits out for as many coves as I can and spread them through the streets. Your job will be to cover the aft castle, just in case, and see you know, we'll get this captain and his little bomb too. Right? Onwards to the Apt Castle. Oh, we're actually being up leveled again. It's actually quite nice looking. I will most likely see Jack running somewhere as well. The fox picked the Grand Knight to roll in thick. 
Uh, this will make things interesting. That's interesting to say. There's the yellow jacket. Our presence on the street is far too thin. Where are the reinforcements I ordered? My apologies, Captain. There just aren't any more soldiers to spare. The bulk of our forces has already been assigned to guard not only the Admiral, but a number of high-ranking personnel as well. Unacceptable. What would Commodore Rayner be thinking? There are dangerous criminals stalking the city as we speak. Call in squads from outpost if you must, but I want to see our security uh, fight uh, tightened and the popula uh, populace properly protected. But Captain, we can't be certain the pirate's plan hasn't changed. If we consider the possibility to have switched the target outside of the walls, it would be folly to weaken those defenses. Hmm, you've made your point, Sergeant. Return to your post. Once all is lost, it is far too late to question what I should have done. Oh yeah. Oh, he is the captain. You seem troubled, sir. Perhaps can I be of assist assistance? Bum. Ah. I've been dying to meet you, lass. I keen to set eye on the bald yellow belly that costs our crew a fortune in Uldan coin. Coin, not coin. Coin. You, you're an executioner, one of the captain's men. Uh, you've strayed too far into a world you don't understand, Les. Your eyes is fixed on the light of justice leaving you blind to the chasm opening up at your feet. You see the captain? <clears throat> well. One lala fell down. At least you can say a die with your boots on. Oh no, he's the captain, for sure. No, actually he is, look at that, that's the Captain Windward, yeah. The yellow belly won't be bothering us no more. Oh, never mind, Captain. As for the mine, the lads have uh, primed the forces of the range. By the time they get there... Yeah, okay, he's the Captain, okay, good. Not long now before we drag that bitch admiral, a pretty tower, and all the Sempron curse down to the bottom of the sea. Then I'll raise our flag on the ruin of the mizzenmast and lead our brethren into the return of the old ways of blood and plunder. I guess he ain't dead yet. <laughs> I should have had the last bottle. Bottles. My wife is gonna kill me. Yeah, she is. Eh, what's this then? Oh, we're awful. Uh, not after the command room. They mean to bring down the entire tower. Oh, he's going to be telling Jack. The mizzen mast falls, the bridge will follow, half the city will... <laughs> oh. 
Please, you must help me. The danger far greater than we... He's drunk, dear. Bloody hells. It's alive. Oh, no, 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 no. I didn't see nothing. Didn't see nothing. Yep. Please, you must send word. Someone should have heard this shot. Someone must be told. There we go, Captain Bandage to the rescue. How did you... The shot, yeah. A valiant and forthright weapon. You could hear the signal pistol, you could hear the single sh uh, pistol shot from mom's away. Haven't heard to... Isn't, weren't hard to guess what happened. I poked the yellow jackets on my way over. A healer will be along shortly. Better. That means we have one last thing to do. Win the competition. Uh, but we've never been allies. But I beg of you. You must. You must stop them. Save the city. Yeah. Ah, less. You know you don't need to ask. Taking down mad coves and biting back was uh, what was biting is our job. And biting back was bitten was okay. Yeah, it makes sense. You all set then? Yeah. Ready, Jack. Always. Not. Into the fishes. Then let's clog that sarcophagus and fit the um, the azabeth in your coffin. Let's go. Time to go and slay them. I think we need to go over there. Well, actually, he's, fight he's fighting over there. That one seems to be off limits. Yeah, okay, let's help. Get away. Uh, this is a gunner with a bow. Not really a gunner then, really. Come on. Gotta keep the crew together. Don't want anyone to die. This is no easy go. No one to heal. Oh, never mind. He can heal. Let's go after these guys. Yep, 
Yo, Jack's are fighting as well. Next. Captain's quite low, actually. Did not expect that. My heal is back up. Won't be long until they target me, probably. I sure love that skill. Detonating in 90 seconds? Oh, that is the sarcophagus. Never mind, it's so close. 90 seconds? You've got to be kidding me. We have like 17 minutes. What are you talking about? See, I can't do anything with this. 60 seconds. Oh, how? Seriously. Like, this guy needs to go, so we'll have that go. He won't die. Why not? He seriously, look at that. One point, zero point one. I don't have any options to deal with it. See? Can't do anything with it. Oh, I see. Detonator. Ah, okay. Makes sense. Never mind. I kind of messed up then. Detonating in five. Yeah, we'll never make that. There you go. We all die. We were too late. Yeah, okay, let's do it again. That's... He's going to tell you, hey, you want to go lower your level? Yeah, no, just go easy. It wasn't difficult. I was just confused on what to do. Because I was busy just kicking ass. While well, we need to not kick ass and just go. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm skipping the cutscene. I don't want to see all of that again. Let's go. We'll still help them. Because why need them? But I'll pay more attention to certain areas. Just get him, please. Okay, now they'll deal with that while we deal with the rest. Can't go there. 
Gonna go here. Check ramps up and going down. Sure. I needed to skip the night. So yeah, two streams. And the stretch. Uh, I need to get some new drink. And I'll do the stretch the second I am safe. Ish. Why did I do that? Oh no. Here we are. Okay, let's go to the rest of the gang. So they can have my back. They're still alive, which is good. So how are you doing, Lord? Um, how's your day going? Uh oh, I'm pinned down. No. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. I just got some jambalaya cooking currently. Been up my water intake. Been over to some issues. Probably doing better than some. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is going to be round three. Okay. This time I'll, I'll just definitely kill the people protecting it. I could probably still do it with the 90 seconds. Because it's quite near to each other. So we are on the right path. Took me three rounds. Oh, okay. Got this one, we need to do it. We will do it. It is quite an annoying mission. Samurai mission level four. Actually, um, one in the FC was talking about the... Uh, is that the one where you're fighting on a boat? Per chance? Yes, and he was talking about it. He was absolutely going ballistic about it. That's some bullshit mission and all. <laughs> oh, looking forward to the samurai then. I'm thinking about doing... Because I'm like in the store, MSQ level 24. I want to do the, the white mage. In a second. But I would have to get it up to level 24, which is annoying. What is usually the level that you would go and do another class? Like, is it whenever you just over level or just go like level 30? Because MSQ level 24 is not really helping me right now. Jack is not doing good. I'm going to kill this group uh, with the exception of Baldwin over here. Because he is a captain. Mm, I don't recall the song might be difficult, but... No, and, and Helen, Ilias, or like Heretic was actually talking about that. He also found it extremely annoying. Because of its, its close quarter combat stuff. Okay, once we get the message for 90 seconds, we have one and a half minutes left. It's more than enough. And I want to make sure that this is actually on the way. I'll keep him for what he is. And once he does, goes down, we'll just deal with the rest. 
Um, got my level set with my second at level 10. After that, you always keep them both with the 10 level of each other. It becomes a bit too grindy. Yeah. So I got a Marauder level 30, which I still find is extremely. I don't know. I, I just feel like I never be able to keep back run. But I got myself earrings now with a bit more tenacity. So maybe that will help. But currently I'm like... Both of them are level 30. And I'm in MSQ level 20... Um, 25. So I could go level 35 then. seconds okay start throwing daggers you'll follow me nevertheless all right here we go Got a new glam. Okay, cool. Uh, what's the new glam you got, Ellen? It's it's fun because I'm talking in the FC on the uh, the link boss world link shell and twins. My main with warrior didn't touch second class to level 50. Now I'm wow. Uh oh, why am I stuck again? What, what what's this bullshit? What would I look like if Odin was an Imperial spy? Crispy meat. Oh. Three times the charm. Three times the charm. Yes, mate. Uh, what's the image again? Oh, that was me just... I When I got the... The cool thing. Like that. Status report. Oh, well, she's very much not dead. Uh, the mine has been disabled and the engineers should soon... Uh, and the en engineers should have it safely removed... Our soldiers sustained some injuries in the battle with reformists, but none were fatal. Also, the Admiral sends us a serious gratitude. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Look, there she is. That's Captain Millerman, the hero of Limsa Liminza. No, she's not, and she knows it. Are you recovered from your wounds, Captain? 
I've heard how you very oh, how you nearly lost your life stopping a horde of pirates from blowing up the mizzen mast. Three cheers for the yellow jacket, our city we lost without you. What uh, what level was your uh, your character again here on Adamantois, uh, Lord Doctor? Oh wait, that's not how it. Sergeant, what of the rogues? Did they survive the battle? Don't rightly know, Captain. All we found near the sarcophagus were reformists, either dead or strung from the rafters. Yeah, the stronging is definitely us. Yeah, we like to tie people up alive then. It would seem we are deeply in their depth. Um, all this level 52. Cool. Good to know. Ah, Captain. Might I have been the silver sorrows from you now. We've been ordered to hand them over to the Commodore, along with the black sarcophagus. Why, of course, they're right here. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's all. Oh, I... Yeah. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Yep. Ah, uh, we stole them where you were bleeding out. That's how we do it. Oh, that chat I knew he was not to be trusted. <laughs> I saw you playing on your main uh, last time when I was streaming during the night. So you're doing the, the newest patch right now, like 6.4, I believe it is. Keep an eye on them, indeed. I should have known. Look at that smirk. Were you also MSQ level 50 with that? Are you sure about this, Jack? We should have cloyed the sarcophagus as well. I'm doing Antwater Stalker. I'm a bit far behind. <laughs> I, with, with Daily Fix, I'm post Heaven's Ward. Uh, but I'm, I'm actually, I'm going to be, I'll be focusing Final Fantasy more and more because I really like this MMO. I've been playing it like an ins like an absolute imbecile. I think she earned it, don't you? If it bothers you as much, think of it as a trait. Mm -mm. If you ask me, they took it a bit daft. Well, I didn't ask you. So, the jacklets end up with the mind, and we've got the diamond and the earring, which means victory belongs to the rogues guild. Do you think Melifel will leave it at that then? It will be... Will be... Uh, I'll get the feeling we ain't done... We ain't done with her yet. I, I think you're right. I'd say we're done with a challenge. But you never know how our paths will cross again. We just have to see what limbs as underbelly spits up next. Just remember to keep the story in your mind. It will be lost by time. By the time you hit Shadowbringers. Yeah, wow. I... I know... I've just... The story picked up insanely, like, in Heaven's Ward. It was so good. Holy crap. But now I'm at Stormblood, and I'm hearing rumors Stormblood wasn't as good. And then Shadowbringers is probably going to be extremely good. Aye, the city ain't ever quite for long. Well... It's been a pleasure working with you, Una. If you ever need a trusty pair of stabbers by my side, I'll know who to ask. Wait, is that it? I'm off as well, bloody starving, I am. Don't forget to... Yeah. Oh, my... Oh, that power conserving is absolutely atrocious. How do I turn it off? Uh... Off. Okay, now I need to do that on this monitor as well because it's going to be complaining shortly. Settings. General. Smart energy saving. Off. 
Um, don't forget to wear for one a bit when you can, Una. Um, Stoblin's kind of goes away thing. Shadowbringer ties back the dragon. So and all the things from Stoblin's kind of doesn't. It's own thing. Open up. So, uh, do you reckon you'll ever play on the alt again? Asking out of a lot of curiosity, of course. We'll best head back to the sisters to afford the screw the sides. So you rather hear us cry crookly. He, I don't get what he says at all. Out of everything he says so far. Oh, for fuck's sake. Shit. He's wearing bloody earrings. Ah. Oh. Oh, that did not look good. Not currently. No, I bet. A distract by Legend of Zelda, Tears from the King. Is it good? And then the Gundam release, of course. I still need to play the first one. The first Zelda. Uh, ask yourself. Um, I'm at the Inn and Ulda if you want to see the answer. He says, said good work. I'll go to the... I'll finish this cloying victory. And then I'll go to Ulda, the inn. Because I want this over with. Yeah, I'm thinking I still want the third character. I don't know why a third class. And then rotate between the three. If I've tried the first one. Uh, if I tried to... Oh, wait, that's too either. Never mind. I'm horrible at those games. Seriously horrible. Ooh, that's not good. There you go. Oi there, Una. It's nice to finally have a bit of rest day. The job never ends. But even a dimmer damber like myself needs to breathe every now and again. And your your adventuring mage must be wondering where you've gone to. That was a long, a, a proper long assignment. And I'm glad you decided to see it through. You've proved... You've proven to be a stalwart protector of the code, even if it isn't truly your world. When you're walking back into the lightments, you'll have to find your own code to uphold. And when you do, you'll have the skill you learned in the shadows to help you defend it. Okay, so we're, we're going to be finding new... Daylight... Assassins? Well... That's more than enough brittle prat out of me. Your travels might take you far and wide, Una. But no, you're always welcome here at the Sisters. Um, we're going to be getting the top, because I don't like the top I'm having currently. Tears improve on brethren, doesn't really make... Uh, well, it doesn't really reference it, though. Wait, what? They, they took six years? Wait, peasant by day... Yeah, I don't want to do this just yet. I say that. Pride of duty. Ah, oh, damn it. We need to do it. Shit. We are level 30. It doesn't make sense not to go get um, to like the next uh, class thing. It's stupid if we don't. I did not want to do that. Um, but I will go to the inn in Ulda first. Because I said so. And then we'll go back. Uh, we'll do the Jack mission first. And then do the Marauders. So we'll play on the Marauders from then. Till level 50. Looking mighty fine there.
and do a wave. Let's go to the inn. Ah, there we go. Oh, wow. Okay, let's go sit. Um, oh, that was not the best place to sit. Holy crap, man. That looks amazing. That is badass. Look at that hat. Holy crap. That looks amazing, dude. That is... Insane. That is a really nice hat. I did... And you crafted this? Damn. Cool. Really cool. Um, Imperial Odin... Uh, it's, it is kind of mad. Got a second one. Remember the Cloud Glam. Uh, none got help farming. Still, it's amazing. I didn't even know there was so much. Damn, this is... Yeah, that is great. Do you have a larger sword as well? Is that why you got on Samurai? Oh yeah, the glasses. Frick, yeah, dude. Like it. I just turned off my music. Got them by sheer luck. Oh, I should start checking out what I got. I never do. That's, that's really cool. That really is cool. What's a drop? Still, it's a good drop. This is a good drop. Um, that glamour makes me think of the Galbarian soldier armor from Final Fantasy VIII. <laughs> yeah, man, looks absolutely great. Um, okay, cool. Also seen your... I, I did see a picture of your Samurai Glam. It looks great. Um, looks very... No, this is not the picture I've seen. Is this a Samurai? This doesn't look like a, a Samurai Glam. Ooh. Yeah. Ah, that's cool. That is very cool. Absolutely cool, I like it. There was the other one that you posted, like the red, uh, red uh, samurai. It was also nice. Yeah, it's very... Um, there's something funny, I didn't know. The bandana would match. It does, actually. It matches quite well. With the tribal and all, it looks like the white it just keeps going through. Yeah, very nice. Alright, then let me go back with the thing. In La Nostra, unless there's something else you wanted to show me. It does look absolutely amazing. I see so you figure out the color in the shirt is uh, way is undiable. Ooh. That must have been a pain in the ass to get all the colors right then. It must be a pain in the ass. So, I matched the others. Yeah, it looks great. Really looks cool. I should really start looking into that stuff. Like, it's it's a power, part of the game that I've never really explored.
Actually, one other. This is the Templar. Yeah. Yeah, it looks freaking heavy, dude. Definitely nice. Let's go. Very, very nice. This is cobalt. I, I, I'm not familiar with any pieces of armor. Uh, but it looks great. Matching colors was a nightmare. It, it, yeah, I don't have much colors either. either like, oh. That. Equip that as well. Um, sunset orange bone white. And I got some red, apparently. I can bet. Uh, the chest piece is primary and the secondary color. Oh, I've never looked into glams. I wouldn't even know it even if, if there's paint buckets. The colors get easy. You just use the market. When you just use the market. Okay. Some of these colors are absolutely insanely priced. I've noticed that so far. Oh. Before I forget, I need to go to the to the house. Um, so if you turn to Gobu Grey Dye, Gobu Grey Dye, the undershirt will be charcoal. Gobu Grey Dye. You can look at the colors by going into the dye system, and then the the dye system. Wait, that's just, that's an other thing that's in here, I think. Why am I always naked? Let's not do that. Oh, I see. Oh, damn. Oh, and it does tell you the general purpose. So, pastel green dye. You don't possess this. Yeah, I, I bet I don't. Select another item. Again, all of my clothes disappear. Can I select an option? Right click on armor. Yeah, oh, yeah, try on. Um, yeah, but every time I'm naked. Like, I don't need to... Like, I'm not into this. Yeah, we'll talk about that another time. I'm not going into that right now. Pick a color, click apply. And that sounds very simple. Anyways, let me go to the house. And thank you for showing me those. Wait, where is the house? The mist is... Okay, this is the house, yeah. Thanks, man. It's, it looks great. Way to go. Keep it up. One day I might look good as well. So yeah, we've been working on the house a tiny bit. Not as much. Got some stuff going. Oh, it's all done. Let's take a look. Harvest. I'm just hoping that we'll get... Some of the roots or some of the... Um, how do you call them? Some of the seeds we need to go to the next... Uh, face to get the onions. It's 
Let's take a look. Um... Ah, here we go. Yeah, the coral root seeds is what we need. And we have four of them. That's actually a good harvest. Now, one of the other things we can do with the root is train chocobo. Oh, I don't have that learned yet. Never mind. I will drop everything into the chest. Once you get lost into the dice, you will never get out. Oh my. Yeah, I'm worried about that very, very much. Should make this a high level, but... Uh, four. Apple seeds, and we need... Uh, there we are, curl this one. So, we need to get... Uh, Vix, Vix seeds or something. Also, I forgot to turn back my fuel, it seems. Uh, lemon seeds. Oh, nice. Don't have that one. Uh, let's place in now. Nah, we'll do, we'll worry about all of that junk later. Use that, and let's go back to Limsa. I spent about 30 hours on Glam once and started messing with it. Each class gets a different one and I have a Glam like, oh damn. Yeah, it seems like you're, you're opening up like Pandora's box. Speaking of training, I found some material for Chocobo features in the chest. Uh, uh, carrot. Carrots? Okay, let's go to the... Fisherman's Guild, and we'll continue with the rogue. Some green stuff. Wait, you mean Grizzle Greens? Grizzle Greens? Is that what you you mean? Thirty hours. A hidden farmable. Um. Oh, okay, yeah, I think I know which one you mean. So, the soul of the ninja, and we get an ability. Uh, mark a ritual mundra hand, jester for heaven. Duration is six, uh, six seconds, maximum charge is two. Triggers a cooldown of weapon skill, mundra and ninjutsu upon execution. Conversely, execution of weapon skill triggers the cooldown of this action. Mom's all green. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I should have those in my inventory as well. I don't know what it will do, but I've, can you use them for summoning them? I don't know. Okay, let's go. Ah, une. Keep your stabbers, uh, stabbers sharp, I hope, cause I've got a job. I got a, got a job to be done, and I reckon the dimmer dabber that puts the executioners to the chopping block is just one to do, to do in. My men have sighted some shifty types round Wineport of late. No code break occurs so far as I know, and that's the rub. We don't know half as much about them as I like. They claim to be simple peasants, refugees from a far-flung realm, but I don't know many peasants with sulk about in the darkness as much as I've been doing. As long as they, they're not breaking the code, they, can't do, they can do as they please, but being who we are, it falls to us to look into the matter and make sure that's all Bob. As my gut tells me, this may be a two-rogue job. I've sent on the foot on the head so put on your best be the cates and uh, head to wineport and meet them there now wineport is somewhere i've not been 
go in yet. So I'm unattuned. But we can go to Costa del Sol. And we can take the ferry. So let's do that. Yeah, the regular grains are for summoning. Okay, cool. Um, the carrots that we have in the bank, you can use that to train up your chocobo as well. Um, they will. You will have to leave your chocobo in the stable. Uh, how does that way deal with my dinner? So the oh yeah, Man, I've, I felt um, I said like um, dealing with the glamours, like spending thirty hours on that. That is no joke. That is definitely no joke. Okay, that one's done. Complete that. Uh, we still have a few others to turn in. Like fancy little chocobo. I should look into that. But I feel like there's so much I still need to do. Like the beast tribes. Everything else. Okay, so graphic-wise, it's been very solid. I think the dynamic resolution has been a bit annoying. Let's see if that changes anything. Like, I'm at 55, 54. That's just so far so good. There's so much content, yeah. Uh, oh, I was completely like, where the hell do I need to go? It's over here. Let's go. I, uh, I started, when I'm doing gathering, I started gathering them with the stack. So every time I'm gathering, I'm gathering a hundred. I will most likely drop everything in the FC bank, but there's not enough room. Even if we get six taps. I didn't even know you could get six taps. Ooh, something's behind me. <laughs> <laughs> I really enjoyed that one. C is absolutely insane. I like this armor more than the other one. At least I'm not looking at my bra. It's so weird when I'm saying that. Seriously, I can hear myself say it as well. Une, when Jack said he'll be sending one of the guild's canniest mods uh, uh, along after me, I had a feeling it might be you. Now, I love to tell you old underfood already windled the old scrap on our friends, but the truth is I've turned up more questions than answers. They claim to hail from the South Sea Isles, but my little bird at Mill Vans gate swear to the last man that uh, hydration that that some piss poor memories. There is no record of any ship sailing into port. Yeah, <laughs> you need your wife here. Yeah, she'll be like, honey. Are you looking at your bra? Question mark? I can see that look on her face. Completely. Looks like it's false to you and me to, to take a closer snitch eye. I hope you brought your sharpest ever. There's no telling who we are. Did you hear that, lass? I don't hold on the food going daft or something more just screamed out of my out of out for dear life. Something tells me our little task is about to take a turn for the interesting. What say we go see what that was? Yeah, I don't think I need my chocobo for that. Under the bridge? Maybe. It's a queer mate. Hello there, queer mate. Ah, oh, 
Have mercy, I'm but a simple milkmaid, with not a single guilt to me name. I don't buy it. Rest easy, lass. My friend and I don't mean you no harm. Though I must say, uh, we've got me, you've got me curious. Just what in the name of the Twelve happened here? I just had to come down to town to purchase some supplies. No sooner had I walked through the gates than I was suddenly across by three burly drunkards who demanded I hand over all of my possessions. To my good fortune, it seemed the men had partaken a bit too heavy, heavily. When the when they saw the meager content of my co coin purse, they began to squabble along themselves. Fist fighting ensured, and therefore I knew it. The three men were lying on the ground, as you see them now. Sounds like they almost smiled upon you today, lass. Though. Might I suggest you be a bit more careful on your next visit? All manners of discovery swords frequently fr uh, frequent these parts, and you'll find that not all of them are blundering lackwits like your friends here. Thank for your concern, good sir. I rest assured that I will take your uh, words to heart. Good day to both of you. Oh man, she is definitely kicking ass. Well, you know, how did the girl with strike you? Memory, I say. Memory. I don't even know what memory is, but it's memory. You too. I was thinking the very same. Squabbling along themselves. Just look. There are barely any scratch on them on these low. Yeah, they didn't punch each other. I wish there's more to the rum doxin than she's letting on. Come, let's go on and drag and see what. What she might be hacking. Ah, let's go tail. Let's go tailing. Wait. A bat? Oh, this is such a tiny ninja. Peasant by day, ninja by night. Well, can you have a more sp Spoiler heavy title. Just don't say we have to wait until nightfall, which is. Uh, it's morning. Oh, here's the next one on the ground. Yeah, she is not wasting time. She be kicking ass. And the right mess we've got here. I reckon those cove got the wrong side of our lass. One thing for sure. The no meager peasants and... Uh, no meager, meager pagan peasants than you and I. One I took... Uh, one look at those stabbers tells me as much. I have failed. I beg of you, take this and return it to Master Oboro. The Lady Stubain. Yeah, you failed, all right. It's too late. The poor sword's dead. As for his stone, your guess is as good as mine. A luck charm of sorts, mayhap? It's most definitely not her. She's innocent. Sure. Any road. Will we best start moving for Diobidus? I thought the lass gets away. Her footprint leads into the direction of Opel and Ostra, which we still have to buy to, so that's great news. Also, massive castle over there. The Gallian Empire. Are you stalking me, bro? I'm watching you. Actually, let's get on the Chocobo. Uh, the Coils of Bahamut that... Wait, is that there, the Coils of Bahamut? I still need to do that raid. I have not done it. Um, we'll actually do this mission. That's the star. Oh! Did not know that. Wait, do we need to... Like, kill him? Oh, 
Oh, there is. There we go. Queer maiden. On the floor. I also have the the father, the, the first father or something. Apparently it's a great storyline. She hides behind the tree. As if that could hide her from me. Okay, you look amazing. Oh, okay. Um <laughs> She didn't really think she could fool me with those silly rags, did she? Or did she? Perhaps. She's not as clever as we believed. Told you not to. Yeah, you're right. Oh my god. And a mysterious savior rushes to the damsel's defense. Such bravery, such compassion. Such folly. Little does she know that the girl is... More than capable of taking care of herself. I know. And right on cue. Oboro. The dim leads into the scene to save her. Uh, save is dear little uh, swallow in the most uprising surprise attack the realm has ever seen woman don't need no man mm -mm -mm. Uh, cease your ramblings karasu before i rip that tongue from your body's break Bloody, bloody break? Whatever. Yeah. Our hero is wounded. A stamp through the heart. His childhood friends stand before him. Blades drawn and hate in their eyes. Oh, the tragedy of it all. The audience sobs. And what is this? A couple of bit play uh, players who have forgotten to leave the stage? Did not one tell them their part in the play is long since over. Well. Oh. And the faceless rogue shows surprising skill. Perhaps she yet has a role to play. I will say as much, unlike a certain someone, at least you intrigue me. I I don't know how to deal with this. But all the matter demands our hero's attention. And so the first act must draw to a close. Come, my pet. Oh yeah, that's that one. Oh quick uh, ever quick to retreat that one. The two from Wineport, did you follow me here? Of course I did. Beg your pardon, miss. My friend and I uh, are here on behalf of the dutiful sisters. And you, sister, have some questions to answer. I've lived on the underbelly of society long enough to recognize just a man. Man's more than he seems. So, make this easy on us, lass. Who exactly are you? And what are you doing here? And... We're hoping for both our sakes that it doesn't involve breaking no code. So you're the rogues of whom I've heard so much. Forgive me. We were remiss in not seeking you out sooner. Very well. I shall know all there is you shall know all there is to know. My name is Oboro, and she is Tsubame. That's great. We hail from a village in Doma. Several thousand mounds across the sea, and we, um... But perhaps you have no word for what we are. In your own tongue, you might call us Shinobi. Doma? The Imperial Province? 
the same. Though I did not have to be... Though it did not have to be so, our countrymen fought with honor against the might of the Garlemand. But we lack in numbers we made up for with martial prowlers. It was a battle we could have won. Had we not been betrayed by one of our own... Oh, okay. Our very secret of every move known to our foe, the tide of battle turned into the morrow. Thousands of our countrymen were slaughtered, and that day's end, Doma remained under imperial yoke. The traitorous call joined the imperial ranks as chief of their covert operations, or so they say. That is the man you just met, Karusu. Though, I am loath to call him a man, yeah. To this day, he whispers in the ears of the Gallians, making a mockery of those he once called him friend and brother, but no longer. We have come to Eorgia at our village elder's behest to see that Karasu pays for his crimes with his life. Come to mill a treacherous rook who blew the gap on his comrade. You sound like the right Ben Cove. Consider old underfoot impressed. Hmm, forgive me. This land and its tongue are still new to us. Nonetheless, we were able to lure Katsu here. But more than a few of our comrades gave their lives in the effort. And now this. Was their sacrifice for naught? No, 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 we'll, we'll, we'll butcher the guy. It's fine. There you go. Stone. Ah, you have my gratitude. When one of our kins fall, tradition dictates that we return their soul to the village. That it may rest with, his, uh, with our ancestors. What? Our fallen brother's soul calls out to this woman? Of course he does. Oh, of course he does. Could it be a sign? Are we fated to fight as one? It would make um, it would make you an offer. We will instruct you in our art, the art of ninjutsu. In return, you will share with us your knowledge of this land, that we might serve us, that it might serve us in our mission. Fine, <clears throat> but but Oburu, she is not Doman. She is not of the village. Look around you, Tsunabe. Um, Tsu Bame. Our brothers and sisters have fallen or greatly wounded. And today's failure makes it all too clear. We cannot hope to stand against Katsura without knowing the lay of the land. Can't say I'm thrilled with the prospect of losing a dimmer damber like yourself. But hells, in my younger days, I like... I like being keen to try... My fems at some of those techniques myself. At least the others I can actually know what they say. For him it's just guessing. And the more my Weddle takes in, the more these two strike me as Bernard and Bernard folk. If you're keen to lend them your dandles, I will not be the one to stand in your way. If you know, if you would no more, come to the dock storehouse in Rain Catcher Galley. We shall await you there. Rain Catcher Galley. Wait, isn't that. Yes, that is uh, in Lower Nostra. Uh, who would have figured any road by the, uh, the choice is yours, Une? In the meantime, I'm going ahead to Limsa and report to Jack. Before he comes and gives me a good cloud in the knob. Yeah. English number one. Okay, now, before we do it. Are you kidding me? Now, I wonder how the assassin is going to be playing. Tsubame. Tsubame. I should actually ask my wife. The reason for it is she is... 
able to speak Japanese. Read it, speak it, write it, all of that stuff. For me, I'll stick to Dutch and English. Because I'm a noob. Let's go to the Etherite. We'll bind up there and we'll go to the uh, ninjas. I think I learned this syllable uh, are separate. Yeah, that's as far as I got. I didn't actually bother to learn three new alphabets. In which one of them actually changes because of words and stuff. And I don't know. Now I'm watching at my chocobo's ass. That's great. Wait, what? I thought it would be over... Over here. Okay. Never mind. I guess I was wrong. They were on the same page then. <laughs> yeah, we sure do, man. We sure do. I don't, I'm not sure if they, if she gets it. Um, give me a second, I need to... Uh, did you get my... Whisper. Yeah. Anyways, let's go. So this is... Oh, there we go. Another gatekeeper. And so we meet again, and I am... Uh, am I to take your presence to, me, uh, to mean that you have chosen to accept our offer? Hell yeah, dude. Thank you. I speak not only for myself and... Uh, Tsubame. Tsubame. Um, but for our entire village when I say that you have our profound gratitude. What I would like to tell you next, I would tell you out of the earshot of strangers. Oh my god. Bayakubu has been instructed to let only trusted visitors through the doors behind me. When he speaks to your to your uh, Ayeme, you are to answer Kaede. You need not know what the words mean, only that they will grant you entrance. Oh, I'm going to F that up. He's going to kill me. And stab me right through the gut. Oh, God. Okay, first answer. Enter. Just like that. So freaky. I don't like it. Stop staring at me. Oh, oh yeah, oh I like it. That is some cool looking dojo, man. Welcome, Ine. You stand within the provincial base of operations my people have established in the land of Eorzea. It may not look much, either without or within, but it is precisely the point. We find it a a deal vantage point from which to observe the comings and goings of Karatsu and his men without attracting due attention to ourselves. My fallen brother saw you as worthy inheritor of his soul. To honor his memory, I entrust it to you. But soul alone will not make you a shinobi. No, you will require training of the body and mind. Our art, the art of ninjutsu, originated from my ancestors many years ago. Since then, it has been passed down with each generation, mother to daughter, father to son. We draw power from the world around us, the heaven, the earth, and the hearts of men, and channel the power into physical form. 
I am told that this is similar to your concept of Aite? I, I, I think it's called Ether, was it? Yeah. I must confess that the Eorzean words and ways remain unfamiliar to me. How does this uh, how does one channel this power, you ask? Through the use of mudra. Hand gesture and call forward each of the three forms of energy of which I spoke. The first mudra will teach you to call power of the heavens. In Domra we call this ten. Are you eager to learn? Yes. Attune your soul to that of my fallen brother. Then approach me once more. And it is then that your training will begin. So, Chogobo is gone. Ninja has been unlocked. Hell yeah, guys. Right, well, we do have to equip it, otherwise it won't work. But, there's always a but. It's always a but. Actually, there's not really a but. Uh, I started playing the game and I've suddenly got a lost sound. No idea what happened. The, the, the game is not muted or did it change audio? Audio devices? It could be that. Anyways, let's go to C, press I, and we now have Soul of Ninja. Put that in there. And we will say Transfer. Uh, to Rogue, actually, no. We will do it differently. We'll go here and we'll say... I'm an idiot. Soul in there. Press that plus. Now the rogue is no more. We are now ninja. And we don't have the new skill in here yet. Checking all the devices, it's fine. It's just not output any sound suddenly. Uh, did you hit like any key on your... Like it's it, no, it's not muted. Come on, I'm not. You're not. You're not daft. Let's close that. Let's press P. Actions. So we now got a few new skills. We got ten. Uh, for a ritual, I don't know what it does yet. I'll put it on this bit. It has two charges. But execute specific ninjutsu action coinciding with the combination of Mundra made immediately beforehand. If any other action is used before the Mundra are combined with, with and the ninjutsu executed, ninjutsu will fail, triggering the cooldown of weapon skill. Mundra and ninjutsu are X R uh, I uh, upon execution. Ooh. Restores two charges to all Mundra when height is executed. I have no clue what they mean. So this needs to be active in order. To do these skills I'd say and the duration is six seconds apparently so let's test that out and there we go now we have the shurinken so that's going to be very important that means this will definitely start changing this needs to be Up there, in addition to the deadly weapon skills, ninjas have their disposed special battle techniques known as ninjutsu, which are readied by first making a series of ritual hand gestures known as mundra. 
Okay, so there is Ten Chi Yin. Since you can be executed after combination, combining one or more of the following three mundra in a predetermined order. So it's always either going to be from Ten to Chi to Yin. Interesting. You will learn new mundra as you progress through the ninja storyline. Learning new mundra will open the doors to more complex ninjutsu techniques. Actually here already says Chi Ten Yen Ten. So it's Chi Ten or Yin Ten. And Yin was the final one. So it's Ten Chi or Yin Ten. Or Chi Yin. Chi Ten. Wait, Chi Ten. Chi Ten. Uh, once you've obtained a new ninjutsu technique, you can conf you can confirm the proper mundra order required to execute, and by selecting the icon on the action and trade interface. Let's put it on complex for a second here. So this is another one, chi, and it's yin. So Ten will give Ninjutsu, Chi will give Associate, I'm going to assume it looks like that, and Jin has the, all of these. And we have Action Unassignable, Unassignable, or because they're part of this. Hmm, we might need to change this entire bar. I'm going to assume that this is going to be a very timely matter. A proper dojo, the samurai got one battle in the gladiator arena and bam, you are a samurai. Cool. Uh, the first lesson in the art of ninjutsu. Yes, I can sense it. Though you are not of our blood, the soul of my people is strong in you. You are one of us now, a shinobi. And yet your training has only just begun. Heed my words well, Une. For the shinobi, blade and mind are one. The weak mind give, gives rise to a weak blade. The false mind gives rise to a false blade. But the mind that is strong and true, that blade, will know no equal. Such were the teachings of my master. His master and his master's master before him. The shinobi must keep presence of mind at all time, or his blade may as well be one of grass. I need to practice that actually. That is the lesson of the mind. Now we shall begin the lesson of the body. You will recall that the art of ninjutsu evolves using hand gestures called mundra to summon the energies of heaven, earth and men, ten chi and yin, in the dome and tongue. Mira techniques can be unleashed depending on the mundra you combine and the order in which you do so. But perhaps I'm getting ahead of myself. A child must learn to walk before he can run. To begin, I would see you master your first mundra, ten, the mundra of heaven. Summon the energy of heaven and project it forth. And from your hand will fly a flaming star or Fuma Shuriken. It's a good thing I watch Naruto. I can actually pronounce half of these things. But we'll eat. Thanks, uh, Lord Doctor, for uh, for hanging out. Appreciate that. Have a great dinner. Right sound of this storehouse, you will find a a Mokuyin, a wooden man of the sword traditionally used in Dorma for training. Do as I've told you and strike it with Fuma Shuriken. I will absorb your technique from a distance. Yeah, that sounds safe. There we go. Oh, wow. That was one. Wow, you can only do that once? Oh, damn. It has, says it has two charges. 
So it's like you start hitting it and you go for it. Yes, a giant shuriken. Yeah, <laughs> indeed, a giant shuriken. Yes, that will do, Kune. Clearly, we did not misjudge your potential. Perhaps you have also felt your body become lighter. This is but one another benefit of your training. You may find yourself able to dance through the air with your blades drawn. But be mindful. The true shinobi sees that no movement is wasted. You demonstrate your skill well against the wooden man. But wood doesn't, does not strike back. Your next opponent won't be so docile. Prepare yourself. Wait, I fight him? Okay. It looks like Beyblade. Yeah, it truly does. Okay. Oh, I don't have... Oh, I see how I messed up. Don't have any charges anymore. So... That's quite awkward. Can I not just do this? Oh, I could actually just have done that. Never mind. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, he's my opponent now. Oh, that's a cool skill. I don't have that yet. You're, you're cheating, bro. Oh, I messed up, I think. What's going on with the... Oh, yeah, I messed up. You get the bunny on your head. Okay, so, yeah, I'm hoping for more skills. So that's more fun. I see. What Oroba means to say is that he he's not seeing anyone master the fundamentals of ninjutsu with such swiftness. So, that's not... Is that not so, Oroba? I am capable of speaking for myself to Bane. To Bane. But it is true. Une has exceeded even my own expectations. Her blade slides through the air as fish glide through water. But that is enough training for today now. It is my turn to be the student and you the teacher. You would learn the way you you would learn the ways of Eorzea. If I would learn the ways of Eorzea, you will instruct me, yes? Yes. You have my gratitude, Une. First, I would better know the terrain of the Nostrum. Is something amusing? Okay. My bow, I see. Who would... Who would have thought a simple gesture of courtesy would be so complicated? Like this, is it? Forgive him, Oboru. N uh, has not been quite himself since coming to these shores. It would seem that neither the food nor the climate agrees with him. And let us not forget the stink of the... Oh no, bird horses? All the more reason for us to complete our mission swiftly and return to a more hospitable environment. Anyhow, Bunny, that should suffice for the day. Practice well your ninjutsu and return when you are ready for your next lesson. He won't. It would seem we have some practice to do as well. Okay, that was actually quite fun. I, I quite enjoyed that. But. 
Yeah, where to place that? Uh, the mugging. Increased targets damage taken by 5%. The cooldown is too long. I don't think it needs to be on this bar. I think all of these needs to be down. Faint has also a rather long cooldown. And I think that we want to start shifting them around a bit. I don't use them as much. I can always use the buffs on here. Like so. And then I can use this area to get through everything. So this would be level 35. Yes. That means that we are now ready to go Marauder. Let's go to Limsa. And we'll go to the Marauders Guild. And I wonder who's going to be my teacher. I wonder what kind of skill we'll get, actually. Because they don't give you, like, a real clue. Soul of... Oh, actually, yeah, we actually did see this guy. Ah, Une. Just the woman I was hoping to see. Hi. It's a... It's... Uh, it's plain as day that you've no equal in our guild. And I have a task that I entrust to no ordinary marauder. To wit, I have received a message from an old comrade in arms of mine who now serves as a guardsman in Costa del Sol. It would seem the fighting's grown fierce in those part, and he finds himself in dire need of reinforcements, mind you. This man is no wit levit whelp. He can wield an axe with the best of them. As evidenced by Master Greg. Um, pay good coin for the service of he and his men. No. Any enemy would fluster that bunch is no one to be trifled with. I have sent Sok uh, Soko well, Whip on ahead to tend to the wounded. Seek her out upon your arrival and she'll apprise you of the situation at hand. Hopefully this is not as long. Okay. So here she is. Anyone actually online currently? Would have actually fought some more, would we? I don't know. When. Even the uh, Une, you have ever the sight for sore eyes. A nasty ball of turtles has been prey upon this area of late. Snapping and gnashing at everything inside. Why? Even the best men that Marauder Greg could, could bite could by find themselves no match for the creatures. Word has it that the beasts have, have been sighted swimming in for the lightly guarded northern shore. I would send you there to investigate the cause behind their Burgoyne numbers. Wait, he was... Oh no, that's someone else. Never mind. Can we climb the ladder? No, we cannot. Never mind. Okay, so this is is, is the fell demon. He looks so bloody cool. Really like that.
Didn't we fight him already? Ah, damn it all, Une. We must see this. Uh, we must see to these beasts. Alright, will do. It's so bright. Let's get the fiance on. Let's make sure Welda doesn't get hit. Now we'll be able to use this to actually help us heal a bit. That's it. Devon Elves, there's no end to them. Prepare to fall back. I'll see the shellbacks. You whelps just try not to end up as turtle grub. Oh, he is absolutely badass. That axe, I've not seen it like in. Une, we must do what we can. We were doing pretty good work. Let's uh, get this going. Come on. I'm getting healed. So that's good. Right, I want to see this um, thrill of battle. Yeah, that does help. It's actually quite nice. Wait, she's paralyzed? How? Yeah, that was easy. That was very, very easy. Oh, damn it. I wasn't able to read that. Uh, not as much. We are the Marauders Guild sent here by the ex master. To assist in its defense, I'm Sorka Whip, and this is my comrade, Une. Alright. For the, uh, from the guild, you say, well, blow me down and call me a bogey. Had you told me sooner, I would have introduced myself with proper respect. You're Une, right? Uh, we've only just met, but I see in you strength not found in ordinary women. That said, you unleash the beast within and become a warrior like me. A warrior, you say? So it was you I saw. Brandishing battle techniques I thought lost in the sense of time. 
lost, <laughs> perhaps in these parts. But where I come from, the way of the warriors alive and well. My tribe has been hardening them down for thousands of years. Yet our numbers, our numbers dwells within every new somber, and this is why I left the my I left the mountain where I was raised to come here, and come here. What say you, Ne? Would you walk the path of the warrior with me? Seek me out in Hidden Falls. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Onwards to Hidden Falls then. Seriously? I, I don't want to fight you. Please, no more. Okay, let's go. The warriors of old. We have heard, uh, we have all heard tales, but never once did I dream that I would meet one in the flesh. My memories clouded, but many years ago, it was said there was a young marauder in the company of heroes who could unleash crushing blows, therefore unseed by his comrades. When the company disbanded, he vanished, never to be seen again. Might that be this curious George? Hey, buddy. I cannot vouch for the man's identity, but there can be no denying the display of strength we saw today, nor that he was taken a liking, nor that he has taken a liking to you. This could be an opportunity for the ages. Hidden Falls, was it? Where I and your, uh, were I in your boots, I would head off there without delay. Hey, right, that's actually very, very nearby. I think it's also one of the final things I might do. And I know that sounds stupid. I do want to make sure that I don't go more than 10 levels away from the main quest. So, what we will do, like next time, is we'll continue with the Marauder. And then, when he's level 35... Or 36, whatever the MSQ is. We will switch to the assassin, and but whenever both of them are more than 10 levels away, we will need a new class. I know you would come, Una. Let us begin. Any woman can take up an axe and call herself a marauder, but to become a true warrior, she must prove that she can tame the inner beast that guide uh, that guides the blade. I witnessed your battle with the turtles, and I must say, I was impressed. Uh, you have proven yourself far more worthy of this than I could have imagined. In your hand lies the soul of the warrior, a crystal within which the deeds of a, thou or of a thousand thousand warriors from history are recorded. For countless generations, the soul have been passed on to those of my tribe who choose the path for the warriors to guide them and aid them on their journey. When your inner beasts awake, the runes will resonate, further empowering your will and granting you such strength that you've never thought possible. Today, there was cause for celebration. There is cause for celebration, my friend. For though you and I have ensured that my tribe's legacy will endure, yes, it is from this day, this moment, that I come down from the mountain. Yet, I'm going to be taking a sip here. This game is really bad for the throat. <laughs> um, however, yet, however earnest I pursue my goal, I cannot deny the fear inside me that my mission will untimely end in failure. For you see, when I style myself a warrior, the truth is that I left the mountains before my training was complete. 
and while I carry with me the chronicles of my ancestors, detailing the, art, the ancient arts of war, I lack the ability to fully decipher the text. Yet, there may still be hope, for there is another who fled my village, one who shared my dream of passing on the teachings of the tribe, and can read the tome, my brother. Without him, I fear there is no more I can teach you at this time. Wait, already? There is little more I can teach you at this time. But that will not discourage me from continuing my studies of the Chronicles. Nor shake my belief that further secrets will soon reveal themselves to me. Unde until then, I ask that you will use the knowledge I've passed on to you and continue your training. You must strive to harden your will so that it may endure the stain of future burdens. Good luck, my friend. What did he pass on to me? Apart from the stone. And now the warrior has unlocked. The next one is up level 35. So, here we go again. Uh, this time we'll do it differently. Lead set. And Marauder will do... Yes, transfer that. And this time we'll... Get that warrior in there. Anything I can change? No. How about... Skills? Let's take a look. Oh, you're joking, right? He did not teach me anything, he only gave me... No way. He... What a joke! No skills? Nothing? You got to be kidding me! Okay, let's uh, deliver these quests. Uh, Pop no longer is... With the wolf's den. We need to go to Marbury Rocks, but that is quite far. The Black Shroud Camp Tranquility. Yeah, it's going to be expensive nevertheless, so yeah, let's just go there. We might just get some gear for the ninja. Like I said, we're no longer rogue, so let's switch. Would this be better? No, none of these things are actually better. Let's get money. God, I know I need money. Bravo, madam. Yes, bravo. And that will actually get us to level 32. Uh, arm's length? I did not have that yet? Oh, I didn't. Create a barrier nullifying the knockbacks and draw in effect. Duration is 6, uh, six seconds. Additional effect slow plus 20% when barrier is struck. That cooldown is not funny. Holy crap. Put it in there. Those are cooldowns, man. That is insane. Okay, next up is... Little Chocobo. Let's talk to this fella. So you have successfully negotiated your first few battles with your chocobo. Well done. Tell me, how did it feel? Was it not supremely reassuring fighting with your feathered companion? Your chocobo can make up for your shortcomings or build upon your strengths. Indeed, there are countless ways um, the two of you might uh, complement one another. Though some experimentation you will come to find the approach that serves you best ah before i forget 
I have one last parting gift. A saddlebag for your chocobo. Carrying Rinzel Greens uh, about can be quite cumbersome. After all, uh, after all, and there should be suffice room for your personal belongings, should there be need arise. I pray it serves you well on your travels. There we go, we got solid saddlebag. Saddlebag is great. Wait. Level 30 will get carrots. Bird in hand. I have a lot of carrots, dude. Greetings, madam. Tell me. How goes the training with your evil mount? I could not help but notice that there is some bias towards real life combat. All battle and no bonding makes for for a less noble bird. I see that you already have a fine residence of your own. True. Why not build a stable for your chocobo? Uh, closeliness leads to founders and there's other... Oh, we'll, the, we'll actually learn how to tend to chocobo. Indeed, I could tell you of those and more, if you wish. We of Isgard have a knack for chocobo husbandry. We have forgotten more than Gar uh, than Gridania will ever know, I fear. <laughs> okay, that's... Oh, wow. That would rub me the wrong way. One is guardian neck is to stable chocobos at one's residence. That makes it possible to train and feed the bird. The second neck is to keep the stable meticulously clean and pick up. Chocobo are cleanly creatures and easily distressed by sovereignly housekeeping. Shall we get straight to it? Pick up every vegetable scrap lit at the stable if you please. Great, we're going to be cleaning his scrap. Okay, you've collected all the vegetable scraps. Very good, I will take those. Our place is fresh and uh, the place is as fresh as cream. How well the chocobo looks, fluffering their feathers in contempt. Contempt, oh whatever. I would do well to lay in a magic broom. You shall need to use those for a proper cleaning, but that is for another time. There is more to stable care than simply cleaning. And that brings us and that brings us to the third is guardian neck. Fresh feet. It might not it might uh, I am not the aptest tutor for this craft, however. There is one that has the neck right here in Brand Branch. That would be Mistress uh, Margafu, Bar Gald, the resident botanist. She is in charge of all cl cultivars maintained, maintained here for the chocobos. Go to her and bag a few greens and information from her. She will not stint you on either. Okay. Some feet for your chocobo, aye. You've come to the right place for it. It has been a warm spring. Try the carrot root. Many birds who would otherwise go off their feeding carrot resist this, their lustrous roots. We raise them with love as well as skill. Um, Master Lucolot likes to call that a knack. I have no quarrel with it. It's a joy to grow, whether it be a vegetable, chocobo, uh, chocobos, or the skill in one's hand. Why not try your own hand at growing vegetables? You say you have a house, a house must have a field. Food grows on your love and care. How could your birth not thrive? 
eat, uh, eating feet such as that. Mayep, we are not that we we are not what we eat. Otherwise, my father would be a codfish, a swim in butter. That actually is a good point. But the feet certainly makes chocobo. I so sens sensitive is their nature that you can see the effort of a particular feed as clear as day. But I have to tell you about the main feeds. You are sure to be fascinated. Oh god, it's going to be f taking forever. Shall we ever try... Uh, shall we ever tire of speaking of Genzel Greens? Um, precious, luxurious plants. You can summon and train your birds with these greens. But as wonderful as Ganzel greens are, they are hardly unique in being attuned to specific areas of your chocobo's abilities. The art of raising chocobos involves choosing a balance of these vegetables to feed to your bird, thus creating a chocobo that is, well, just so, the best laid plan to wrangle. Wranglers are often frustrated by a picky eater. Though, do make sure to come to know each bird likes and dislikes. There are no um, pieces of maggot attack to bend to our will. But when birth and woman grow together, why? You must discover something very special indeed. Aye. And you would do well to grow your own feet. May, may as well fight with a spine sword to raise a chocobo without a vegetable field of your own visit a store to buy seeds and remember love and skill these the neck there is the neck okay i do go on don't i yeah you do you came for a handful of feet and got an earful but that is the way of it with us but but botanist take this fine specimen of kara root to uh, your sweet chocobo and I wish you both the joy of it. Will do. We are able to collect the chocobo feed. Uh, Margold is never standing with her vegetables. Go. I have I think like a hundred in the bank. As fine as a carrot root as ever I've seen. A majest a magnificent mask Yeah, I'm tired. It's almost 4 a.m. A magnificent magnificent specimen. This will make the training all the more effective, I believe. To come forth necking chocobo husbandry in a training. Um I heard that I heard head wrangler Keda about her work. There's a thought. Oh, you got to be joking. Go on and speak with her. She will tell you much and much more about training chocobos. Jesus. Nice to see you, Venturer. Here to learn about training your bird, you say. Stay with your chocobo and you'll be able to train the sweetheart. But you need to give him the treat straight after and not a moment later. What I do is... To go pick up a chore, pick up a choice bit of feed before I get the bird into training. The results vary, as that slick ruffian at the ebony stall used to say around here. Results depend on how clean the stables are, what treat you give, but as long as you love your chocobo, it's hard to mock it up. Well now. Got a fine root, a carrot root, on you already. That will work as a treat. No pun intended. Go on, start training little Leia over here. He's kicking barrels. Yeah, kicking barrels. Not a. Go on. He was kicking barrels. He's so happy. She is so happy. Whatever. It.
Well, hopefully this is not alone. That was sweetly done, adventurer. You've got some skill at this, I reckon. Some are made to train just that one bird, but you can handle any chocobo. Some venturers share a stable, you know. Might be you could care for birds other than your own. You mock out the stables, that means you're helping raising another venturer's bird as well as your own. No matter who, who did the mocking out, really, those birds have been cared for, you see. That'll hold you for a while, eh? No use pouring too much wine into a cup. You'd best return to Liquilot before his Iscardian brain case starts imagining the worst. I just hope he says you are ready. Thank you and bye. Sweetly done. High praise indeed for from Keita. Excellent, excellent. I've now taught you all the necks you must need to know at this time, I believe. It is my hope that you will add a stable to your residence and then there raise a chocobo to serve as your brave mount and trusted companion. How I long to meet a bird I, I long to meet that bird someday. I trust you will not disappoint me. We'll do that in a second. Uh, now we go to Limsa. I f no, we actually we're not. We're going to Dry Dogs. Can't go anywhere else. And let's run. We'll do the pop no longer. We'll get 2,000 of these FC tokens. I might just drag it out a bit by just doing those. Onward to the wolves then. No, I actually won't. 4 a.m. is quite a bit. Okay. Apparently, PvP hot bar. PvP profile. Another sprint. Execute the following weapon skull in success in heavy swing. Okay, so this is a the combo, really nice onslaught, overlay, bloater, primal screen, elixir. Don't want my elixir over there. Recuperate is a healing skill, guarding skill. This is a sort of a buff to get rid of any states. Is a oh my god, my HP is growing like crazy. Is there a striking dummy over here? There actually is. I want to test that out. Actually, first things first. Yeah, we are now attuned. Uh, let, let's go check out this combo. That really is clever. Can you make these? That is so cool. Wait, that did did that just cost me HP? That follows up. That's actually quite good to know. You can change these inner rotations. That's nice. I like that. Uh, reset striking dummy. Wait, what? I might look into this PvP stuff. There's the captain. 
I don't recall seeing your ugly mug around here before, hmm? You say that Ricky sent you? She said she was sending a new wolf to the den. <laughs> More like a run to the litter, if you ask me. You barely have fangs for, be, uh, for the honing. But I guess I'm feeling goddamn generous, so I'll throw you a bone. Start yourself up with a crystalline conflict. Them training bouts are specially made for reckless adventurous type who can't just tell sound strategy from horse arse. I still reckon it won't be midday before you run home with your tail behind your legs, between your legs, crying for your mum. But you can have a word with Lieutenant Gunji something if you insist on giving it a go. You found him outside, assuming you can woke up, work up the nerve, and stand straight, maggot. This ain't no place for the weak of spine. Dismissed. Such a friendly fella. PvP has been unlocked. We'll probably get a tooltip. Crystalline Conflict has been unlocked. And it is now in the duty roster on the PvP. Crystalline Conflict. Casual match. Ranked match. What's what, what, actually... What do we get from that? Nothing. Okay. Nothing. Interesting. Oh well. Yeah, it's fine. Crystalline Conflict entrance over there. Not going over there right now. Foot at the door. The only thing apparently I am able to do... Let me think, is that true? Not really. Can I teleport? Not really, because I actually thrown all of that. It's all gone. Oh, that is annoying. Wait, there's actually a blue quest over here. Earning your wings. The crystalline line calls. Yeah, I don't know if I want to do them right now. No. No, we, we, won't. we will definitely go back to PvP, but not right now. Because I would really like to start ending this. Let's go back. We'll go to the guild hall. It's actually strange I cannot teleport over here. Like to the mist, but okay. Let us uh, do something about this. Clean the stable. Stable is clean. And let's tend to. Yeah, he, he has been level 1 for a million years already. So, let's just train... Daily Fixes Bird. Okay. Yeah, you could have been dinner there, bud. And uh, we gained 13,000 experience. And uh, we could train again in an hour. Uh, we're not going to, of course. So yeah, we'll probably get rid of some of the bushes and some of the tiles over here. And get some stables in. And uh, I will see how things go. Anyways. Next up is... We'll start in Little Alamiga. Continuing with the storyline of level 25. Until we hit level 35. So that gives me some time to... Think about what class it is that we're going to be training up. Anyways. I hope you had a great time. I sure as hell did. And I'll see you next time. Have a good one. Bye bye.